Okay, so in this video, we are going to learn about what do we mean by square numbers. Now, to, it is pretty intuitive. What do we mean by a square? A square is a geometrical figure that has same sides and you would have already learned about that so if we have a small geometrical figure we have taken a small one over here which has the same size for that matter let's say that this length is l this length is l right and the area of a square area of this square is given by l times l that is we multiply the length of that square by itself and this kind of gives you an idea of what a square number is Okay, so let us say, let us say that we'll try to find the square of a few numbers starting from one. So what happens when we multiply the first number that is one by itself? So we have one times one, it gives us one. Then two times two is four. Three times three is nine. Similarly, we have four times four is 16. Now I would like to remind you that we could also write these as 1 squared, 2 squared, 3 squared, okay? So using the exponent. So we can say 5 squared, which essentially is the same as 5 times 5, okay? That would be 25. Similarly, 6 squared would give you 36. 7 squared would give you 49. Then we have 8 squared that gives you 64 9 squared gives us 81 and 10 squared that is 10 times 10 gives us 100 now if you look at all these numbers which we have obtained by multiplying a number with itself so if you look at this numbers 1 4 9 16 25 36 49 64, 81, and 100. All these numbers, they can be represented as a product of some number which is multiplied by itself. For example, I mean, that is what we have derived over here. 64 could be written as 8 multiplied by 8. So to put a general notation or to understand how, how, how can we define square, any number, let's say that that number is M, which could be represented as a product of another number with itself is known as a square number okay so in this case M is a square number okay M is a square number okay and that is what essentially squares are now quick question based on what we have taken the squares of numbers from 1 to 100 and the number of squares that we find the number of perfect square numbers so we also call these numbers as perfect squares just for information all these numbers are also known as perfect squares so the number of perfect squares from 1 to 100 how many number of perfect squares you have from 1 to 100 and you can see that there are just 10 perfect squares 10 perfect squares from 1 to 100 as as you can see from over here so this was a very quick introduction about what are square numbers in the next videos we will be exploring some properties of the square numbers into details